the greatest challenge facing the healthcare industry today is containing costs and improving productivity while still maintaining the highest level of quality patient care. Faced with these critical issues, healthcare institutions are searching for new and innovative ways to re-engineer the way things are done, especially in the way information is gathered, processed, and communicated. A company called Telzon Corporation has a new prescription for streamlining the information arteries, the lifeblood of healthcare management. It's called the Wireless Hospital. A prime example of a progressive healthcare facility that has adopted the Wireless Hospital concept is West Virginia University Hospitals in Morgantown. It's a one million square foot, 376 bed tertiary complex spread across the six building campus of the Robert C. Byrd Health Sciences Center. On a typical day, treatment is provided for nearly 1,500 people, including outpatient and emergency cases. Like hundreds of other forward-thinking healthcare facilities, West Virginia has installed a sophisticated fixed station clinical order entry and information system called Computer Handling Information for Patients, or CHIP. The system is designed to reduce paperwork and automate the flow of vital data between healthcare professionals and ancillary service departments. While significantly more efficient than previous methods, this system still relies heavily on handwritten notes and hard copy documentation. Nurses and doctors still are forced to leave the patient's bedside to access the fixed station terminals. In facing the challenge of cost containment, West Virginia had a vision of facility-wide connectivity, a data communications network, which would give healthcare providers instant access to its clinical information system from anywhere in the medical center environment. I'm talking about a clinician having access to the system where they are when they need it, not having to walk, not having to uh, relocate to another area to deal with system inputs. West Virginia considered placing hardwired bedside PCs in all patient rooms, but flinched at a price tag of $2,500 to $3,000 per unit, especially since they would only be used an average of 10 to 20 minutes a day. So it was a $700,000, $800,000 question. Uh, and we still did not have the coverage when we had, would have done that that we really needed everywhere. Working with Telzon's Healthcare Technology Group and CSE, a healthcare systems integrator, West Virginia University Hospitals found the solution. Telzon pen-based portable teletransaction computers, called PTCs, and wireless spread spectrum data communications. The price tag was about one-tenth the cost of hardwired bedside terminals. We took a took a vision of, of anywhere access and turned it into a mobile unit that works over radio frequency and allows the clinician to roam about within the clinical environment uh, with full access to the system. The screens on the Telzon PTCs display exactly the same matrix as seen on the stationary PCs in the chip system, with no custom software required to achieve this real-time interface. With appropriate systems integration, the Telzon units can communicate seamlessly over all major local area networks, including Ethernet and Token Ring, both of which are in operation at the hospitals. What's more, the wireless network can also interface seamlessly with other hospital information systems, such as patient accounting, laboratories, OR scheduling, materials handling, and more. At bedside, Telzon PTCs give clinicians the ability to enter vital signs and other diagnostic data with the touch of a stylus and to order drugs, tests, and other services from ancillary departments on the spot. As an example, a drug order sent in real time right from the patient's room is instantly printed out in the pharmacy and quickly filled. Orders to radiology, respiratory therapy, and other departments are transmitted and responded to in the same efficient manner.
Equally important is the clinician's ability to view the results of those orders in real time from anywhere in the hospital environment. That's critical to physicians like Dr. Martha Mullett, director of the neonatal intensive care unit and chief of staff of the pediatric division. The test result reporting is wonderful. And so we have access to the results of tests and x-rays as soon as they are done. The speed of wireless data communications is especially important in a teaching hospital environment where morning rounds can take up to three hours. At the end of rounds, patient charts were given to the unit clerk for entry into the CHIP system. Only then did the appropriate ancillary departments receive their orders and begin to respond. The Telzon system is changing all that. Now orders are transmitted at the same time they are issued, triggering immediate response from all ancillary departments involved. In today's environment in healthcare, it becomes ever more crucial to save every second you can save. The difference between um, an order that gets entered an hour or two from now when somebody comes back to the nursing station and the order that gets entered right now while they're still in the patient's room can mean the difference between the patient going home today and going home tomorrow. Wireless Telzon PTCs can also be used for perioperative charting in the OR, respiratory therapy analysis, and many other applications. When we bought Telzon, what we attacked was what we call the hidden paperwork. And that's all of the notes, all of the transcriptions, all of the copying down of data that people do in the patient room, in the chart room, in the examination room, anywhere in the facility that they then take back to a terminal and transcribe into it. Tells on real-time communications has also significantly improved record keeping. Accurate documentation is very key to providing any type of patient care not only for le legal aspects, but for actually planning of care and informing and communicating the needs of the patient across all healthcare providers. It's very critical that it's accurate and timely. To facilitate total wireless communications throughout its entire complex, West Virginia is also installing Aeronet wireless LAN cards in the hospital's fixed station PCs. With wireless desktop connectivity, Personnel can quickly deploy a terminal in any location without the time and cost of hard wiring. The connectivity is not just a specific point in a given department, it's any point in any department to any other point in the facility as well. Dwayne Patrick sees three major benefits to the wireless hospital concept. One is it's an anywhere to anywhere connectivity. It gets us out of the mode of having to take the caregiver to the terminal the terminals with the caregiver all the time. The second major benefit is the cost. It, we've yet to find an implementation that we've done here where the cost of traditional wiring is less expensive than the cost of doing it wireless. And the third major benefit is that we believe the quality of patient care will be dramatically enhanced by the ability to move results and orders into a real-time mode. Wireless technology has enhanced patient care in a variety of modalities. Bottom line benefit to wireless technology is that it allows the nurse or any other care provider to stay right with the patient. We think using this system will overall make us more efficient and safer. We hope it will cut down the cost of patient care by allowing us to be more efficient and having fewer FTEs required, fewer full-time people to like carry the papers around. Um, to deliver messages down to the pharmacy, we think we won't need that person. It's done electronically now. Reducing and containing costs. Improving productivity. Quality patient care. They are all part of the anatomy of the wireless hospital. The high-tech solution with a bedside manner. From the Healthcare Technology Group of Telzon Corporation.